But I also give credit to Goff. He's a guy that had a lot of success, but was open-minded to the coaching. He's in trouble here, though. Can't find anyone, and he's going to go down. The f we know he got carted off, and it just next man up. Pressure coming in again. Goff hit as he throws, and it's intercepted. There is Trey Brown. Open to the end zone, and he's going to score. Let's see what happened here as Brown took it back to the house for 40 yards. We've seen them run this little choice route out of the backfield, which Amir gives a lot. And in this case, they zone it off. And if he's wide open, if he just puts that ball on his front shoulder pad, he's wide open. I think the pressure off his right side. Practice the tip drill. Here's Goff. Wants to go deep. Goes deep and throws it to the Falcons. It is already a land up in plus territory. Yeah, and they're just running basic, they call this dagger right here. Run people off, throw it underneath. Third and long out of a tight formation. Packers rush five. Goff steps up, throws, picked off at the 43-yard line by Rudy Ford. And Ford takes it deep into... In this, in the NFL, they always move around guys and make you have to try to think after the snap and you know they just sat in zone it wasn't anything necessarily that should have tricked Jerry Goff Ford was an underneath cup Goff lost the ball I think he got it back and he did blitz coming Goff just gonna go deep and there's nobody home it's gonna be intercepted in the end zone by Geno St Goff started to his left, and he's picked. Intercepted by Marcus Peters. Able to stay in bounds. He's gone. I see no flags. Touchdown, Raiders. Goff is just trying to throw this away, and maybe he was. But Amon Ross St. Brown is out there. I still think he was not really trying to complete that pass, more or less just getting it out of his hand. Second down, Goff in the face of pressure, delivers off target, and for the first time in his NFL career, the Tyreek Stevenson finally has his first NFL interception. The Bears a takeaway. So to the outside, expect that to happen to you. Now first and 20, and Goff throws another one away. And this time it's T.J. Edwards. Interceptionless streaks in NFL history has thrown two in the first half. And converted. Goff now throws. Oh man, that could have been taken away by Jalen Johnson. And had he picked it, it would have been six the other way. Fourth down today. Goff, not good that time. His third interception, and it's another Bears newcomer, Tremaine Edmonds. So they're going for it on fourth down and ten. And Goff is picked up by Jalen Johnson. Still on his feet. Lost the football, but it's out of bounds. There's eight interceptions, five of which he's returned for touchdowns. This screen is intercepted. And the 11th thrown by Jared Goff. Yeah, that's a catch. That's a two timeouts left for the line. Whoa! And an interception picked off by Wilson. What a play. Yeah, really great play. He does secure it.